Congratulations, Sarah, on being a finalist tonight in the High Performance Sport New Zealand Sportswoman of the Year. Uh, how does it feel? Uh, it's just an honour to be nominated. Like, um, I've got no chance whatsoever. It's just cool to be here and just have a night where I can get dressed up and, and be a girl for once. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's this guy. Um, no, I, I think like uh, my money's on Lisa to take it out. Just what she did at the Olympics was just incredible and so inspirational. So, yeah. Um, but Sarah, you you came back from a fairly serious injury not long before the London Olympics and managed to deliver a silver medal performance. Uh, many, many many people found that a really inspiring story. Uh, what what sporting stories did you find inspiring in 2012? Um, Probably the coolest part, and uh, I voted for it a few times, was watching Joseph and Nathan come through in the doubles final. Uh, just their determination to come through in those last 500 metres just to take out their gold medal. That was definitely my, the best moment from the Olympics for me. And where were you when you saw that? I was actually in Denmark watching on a computer screen, um, streaming from the internet, so I had no commentary whatsoever. Uh, but yeah, living in Cambridge and being around rowers and having a boyfriend that's a rower, I knew a little bit about it and I knew if they were stuck in there all the way to the, that point that they had a really good chance of sprinting past for the, the gold and it was special. Uh, and what are your plans for 2013? Uh, 2013 we've actually got the World Champs here in Victor Arena um, in July so I'm really excited about that. I'm actually doing a little bit of recon tonight, <laughs> um, checking the distance from the hotel to the, to the arena and then also... Yeah, or oh, working out whereabouts the start hill's going to be and whereabouts we're going to be warming up and cooling down and stuff like that. So it's actually quite handy.